everyone. It's Leslie from Clementine Nutrition. This month, we're talking a ton about skin health, and this week, we're talking a ton about psoriasis. So in this video, I thought I would touch on the connection between vitamin D and psoriasis. So one of the first things we do when someone comes in and they have a complaint of psoriasis is to make sure their vitamin D levels are at the optimal level. So there's a huge connection between vitamin D deficiency and psoriasis. And also we talked about the connection with psoriasis being an autoimmune condition. Vitamin D plays a role in all autoimmune conditions as well. So you kind of have the double whammy there. So it's crucial to be getting enough vitamin D. So first, let's check your, your blood level and make sure that it's at an optimal level. I would say above 45, above 50 is an optimal level of blood vitamin D. And then at that point, we need to add in some from our diet, but a lot of times you really need to supplement with a really good quality form of vitamin D3 and also make sure it has some cofactors in it too, like vitamin K2 and magnesium. Those will help the absorption of vitamin D. You also want to make sure that you're taking your vitamin D supplement with a meal with fat. And then also we could get outside and get some sunlight, you know, within reason can really bump up our vitamin D levels and then help our psoriasis.